Good morning, everyone. Welcome to the on-time, on-target play of the day. You have three screens in front of you. You have the S&P 500, Amazon Long, and PDD Short. There's the opening bell, so we're going to zoom in on the SPY. You know that things are negative here a little bit with the uh, S&P 500. So let's zoom in on that and see how the market reacts to the open. Uh, for our long, you see Amazon's actually in the red a little bit, um, but I do with their new healthcare announcement that they just really started talking about. You can see the move this morning uh, uh, is already up. So we're going to keep an eye on that long. Obviously, the price point's an issue. You can't take a whole bunch of this because of the large price point. <clears throat> and then PDD is pin duo duo. That is short. And again, chairman stepping down uh, unexpectedly. So you can see that it's selling off uh, 6%. All right, Amazon's really kind of not moving. So let's kill that off of here and pull up another short. Let's pull up plug power. <clears throat> again, plug power ran into some financial accounting issues. So down 15% already. So I'll zoom in and see, here's where it opened at 37, dipped down to 36 already. Kind of too far gone for our strategy for the, uh, you know, out of that five to 10% window. PDD is starting to stripe down. <clears throat> High of the day at 153, it's already moved $5 worth, so really can't uh, can't chase that as well, but we'll certainly keep it on the radar scope and see what happens. Check out CCIV. Again, this is Lucid Motors. No real uh, headline associated with this, and awesome. We have si sirens in the background. That is swell this morning. So see how it's acting, okay, down 5%. Um, I don't know, don't have enough of the headline to know that it's going to necessarily sell off other than it meets our criteria. Uh, if you were desperate, this would be your trade, but you are really throwing a dart here. Uh, 29.8, take it at 29.4, that's a 40 cent stop. Um, again, covering the high of the day. So I'll draw it on here. I'm not gonna take this myself and nor do I necessarily uh, I'm all that excited, but if you are dying to trade, uh, 29.40 is your entry, 29.80 is your upper bound to cover the high of the day, and you have a 40 cent stop, so that means your first 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 R is down here at 29, and then 28.2 is your exit point, so go ahead and get your stop put in there at 28.2. So again, Lucid Motors, <clears throat> again, on a short with the entry up at 29.4. Looks like the market's selling off a little bit, so that's going to be helpful. And we have our arrow drawn in there. So we'll come back and uh, revisit that trade. Uh, so here's your trade. If you're in it, again, enter to 29.4, stops at 29.8, as well as 28.2 is your exit point. All right, let's take a look about what's going on in long term. So here's the trade you have set up in the middle in uh, Lucid Motors short. Again, that's a SPAC, no real headline other than uh, it's been on fire kind of lately. And you can see the spy selling off down and half and along. If you're in this trade in Lucid Motors, I, I honestly, I'd say kill it. Uh, we're up in R. So whatever your risk unit is, you've doubled your money this morning. Let's kill it. Let's not hold out for the 3R like we normally do and uh, go on about our day. Again, if you got, if you want to trade the VXX around the Fed, meet, Fed meeting release, that would be uh, 2 o'clock Eastern. So manage that on your own if that's something you're interested in. Otherwise, happy St. Patrick's Day, and we will see you guys back tomorrow. Bye.